ஓம் நமோ பகவதே ராமகிருஷ்ணாய லெசன்ஸ் ஃபார் லைஃப் ஃப்ரம் சுவாமி ஜெக்தாத்மானஜிஸ் இன்ஸ்பைரிங் புக் லேர்ன் டு லிவ் வால்யூம் டு சாப்டர் டு லவ் த கிரேட் வண்டர் in the name of modernity we must never give up our spiritual and moral values this important subject is discussed in this episode the pomp of modernity in the system of education that is prevalent these days there is no provision to expose our children to the glory and greatness of noble and spiritual people There appears to be a widespread ignorance about the values of life. Who is there to present before young people fundamental values which provide a higher ideal for life, which brings happiness, peace and contentment, which are absolutely, which are as absolutely essential as water and air. On one hand, innumerable details are crammed into the heads of children. for passing the examinations and science is glorified beyond limits on the other hand exaggerated representation in the media of cheap emotionalism sexual indulgence theft robbery violence seem to be misleading the impressionable innocent minds of children Even those who work in the field of education do not seem to bother much about this problem. The so-called intellectuals seem to be suggesting to young minds directly and indirectly that weaknesses in human beings are natural to stand and fight for an ideal is a kind of foolishness. In the name of scientific attitude or rationalism there is widespread publicity both direct or indirect for licentiousness sensuality and recklessness it has been reported that at a public meeting a minister said that within limits ragging is not harmful and young people students express their happiness with a thunderous applause for 5 minutes the spirit of freedom which they see in the west has impressed impressionable indian youth but instead of taking the cue from the qualities of patriotism industriousness civic sense the readiness to work hard which they find in the west they seem to be in a bid to ape and inculcate the weaknesses of the westerners The eminent historian Professor Al Basham of London University who visited India in 1964 said to the press The cinema literature dance and music of the west have captured the minds of the Indian youth who hope to achieve the kind of freedom which the European youth are enjoying This freedom has not brought real happiness to the youth in Europe but Indian youth hope to derive happiness from this type of freedom they may indeed rest this freedom in the matter of a generation or two the restriction on the mixing between men and women the traditional marriage system has kept the families in India stable but freedom in the west is degenerating into licentiousness families are breaking up children often get separated from home and grow in the orphan ages if indians too adopt the sexual licentiousness which has destroyed the basis of family life in the west we can guess what harm it can bring about in our country the western people are gradually realizing their folly they are more and more attracted to the spiritual culture of the orient of the east what an irony of that our people neglect our own culture and are driven to ape the west om shanti 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 हरि ओम तत्सद श्री राम कृष्णार्पणमस्तु